Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. This is Roger Gilbert reporting for International Aquafeed magazine. I'm in Panama City attending the La Aqua exhibition and conference by WAS, World Aquaculture Society. It's been a three-day event. This is the end of the second day, and I'm pleased to say I'm in the company of Matthias De Jong. He's the uh, Central Technical Manager for Aqua for Ofra. And Ofra, of course, is a Dutch company, and it's an equipment supplier to the region. And Matthias is going to tell us, he was speaking on the program, he's going to tell us a little bit about his conference presentation today. Matthias. Yeah, nice welcome. to meet you. Yeah, nice to meet you. So, yeah, uh, hi, everybody. Um, just finished my presentation I was talking about uh, the to improve the feed efficiency grow performance and immunity of white leg shrimp by addition of uh, different selenium sources but in most specific organic selenium based on l selenium and the use of nutritional emulsifier uh, yeah, to help that and what was the uh, reaction from the audience like were they interested yeah, in what they, you had yeah yeah they were very interested especially about the selenium part like emulsifiers everybody knows already a little bit it's to improve fat digestion and, and they also know a little bit uh, yeah, the different products but organic selenium is still something quite new especially in the shrimp business uh, so yeah they were really interested in taking a lot of pictures and also after the meeting we had a lot of questions so it, yeah it was uh, yeah, very positive yeah. And do you think this technology transfer is occurring? That uh, you know we're bringing new technology to the region, or is, is that is that part of the process? Uh, yeah, it's part, that's part of the process. But also in general, the global shrimp uh, feed production, shrimp production is is in a process of becoming more sophisticated, more better, so to say. And also, uh, where in the in the past they just put something in and they grow. They're more paying attention, okay, what do we put in? And, and yeah, selenium is one of the most important sources, one of the most important ingredients. And we really see that by addition of the right source of selenium, you can really help your shrimp to grow better, but also be more healthy. Uh, from my little limited knowledge of uh, nutrition, selenium is a very coastal uh, mineral, isn't it? A very coastal product. Uh, wh why are shrimps deficient, do you think? Um, well. If you look back, like in fish meal and fish oil, there's also always a lot of selenium there. So also in, in oceans, in rivers, in lakes, uh, there's a lot of selenium in the natural feed of shrimp. And when we feed them in aquaculture systems, uh, in the past we used a lot of fish meal, but now we're reducing that and replacing it by plants. And plants are often lacking of selenium. So that's why there's more and more deficiency. So maybe 20 years ago there was never a deficiency in selenium because we used so much fish meal so much fish oil but by decreasing that amount of fish uh, fish meal fish oil with replacing with the plant material you're yeah decreasing selenium content and that's why you need to add it yeah. are there other products like that that we should be supplementing at the moment yeah i think in the, in the end you also have to look at um, uh, certain amino acids uh, fatty acids uh, omega-3 omega-6 the combination of course other minerals uh, uh, i think looking really at the, s the small micronutrients mm -hmm. in the end like proteins and stuff like that protein is not protein but th yeah that will manage it somehow but you really need to look at the small small parts like the mm -hmm. yeah, minerals mm -hmm. fatty acids and stuff like that and you're finding is it obviously growing shrimp is a global activity global business yes uh, and, and uh, shrimp respond well no matter where they are growing on the world yeah, so we have uh, we did the, the experiment we discussed today was in uh, Thailand, but we have some field trials in the Philippines is going well. Uh, we are hoping to start some field trials after this week here in uh, in, in the region Ecuador or Panama. But in general, we hear that adding selenium is is working everywhere because it's so fundamental. It works for every species. We have in shrimp, but we also have experiments in tilapia, poultry, uh, uh, swine, cows. It works for every species because it's so fundamental even we humans need selenium so that's why it, it works so well that's very interesting uh, thanks Matthias for spending time with us uh, good luck in your work in this region and uh, all the best yeah thank you N nice uh, talking to you thank you